When it comes to aerial combat training, nothing beats the real deal, and that's why the US Air Force uses both full-scale and subscale aerial targets. Full-scale aerial targets are basically retired aircraft that have been turned into drones and can be flown by a pilot or remotely controlled for live missile testing. These targets are designed to mimic the maneuverability of most enemy aircraft and have two primary missions. One is pilot training, because it's not a bad idea to practice firing some real missiles before going on to a real mission. Second is weapon testing. As the new generation weapons are developed, they need rigorous testing and what better than a test on a live target. For almost a decade, the BQM-167 Skeeter subscale aerial target has been launched from Tyndall Air Force Base two to three times a week. The Skeeter drone is made up of carbon fiber and epoxy-based materials and each one costs $570,000. But they are reusable because after a rocket-assisted launch, they can be recovered using a parachute system. After assessment and refurbishment, the drone is placed back into service. 